Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Um, I'm Courtney and if you have not been here before then welcome and if you have been then welcome back. Um, today I'm gonna be showing you guys this look. Um, I was gonna do a natural everyday kind of look but then I looked at my palettes and I was like this girl is a beauty head to toe she done win already the girl blessed with a gorgeous body hey, hey. if you guys want to see this look stay tuned because it's coming right I guess I can tell you guys a little bit about myself in this video so it's not long and boring and annoying so watch um, I'm gonna so I'm gonna start off I have um, polycystic ovary syndrome so I usually have to pluck my chin before I apply my makeup because I have hair on my chin um I might do well I have I have I have done a video about it but I haven't posted it yet I'll probably post it sometime soon yeah I did that video when I was in Trinidad for carnival also footage from carnival will be coming soon yeah so i'm just gonna go ahead and i'm gonna pluck my chin hairs and guys i'm just getting the ones that's like thick and like really dark because there are like some really like thick dark ones down there so that's what I'm really focusing on trying to get out oh I was gonna tell you guys about myself so I'm from Trinidad originally um, I'm from Maraval. I grew up in Trinidad from like, obviously I was born there. I grew up in Trinidad f until like 9, 10, I think 10. I left Trinidad when I was 10. Um, my grandmother, she died when I was 9. She used to take care of me. And my dad used to live in Barbados. My dad was born in Barbados. My dad used to live in Barbados and... When my granddad and my, my 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 mom was in New York at the time, so when my grandma died, after that school year, she died in November. So after that school year in June or July, I moved to Barbados with my dad and my two brothers. My dad, my dad, um, my dad was born in Barbados, but. He was the only one out of all his siblings that were born in Barbados. His dad is from Barbados and his mom is from Trinidad. But like, he was the only one out of all his siblings that were born in Barbados. But he went back to live in Trinidad when he were like really young. I don't, I don't think he ever lived in Barbados after he was born until he like got older and moved back here permanently. I use a darker concealer. I mean, I use a darker foundation because when I put a lighter concealer and blend all that in, I think it just works out better for me. And I don't go for full coverage because I don't really care about like hiding my freckles or anything like that. So. I don't really go for full coverage. So I'm using NC50. Ooh, sativa. Time off a time, you got me, you got me high, you got me high, high. Guys, he's talking about marriage of Warner in the song. Yep, ganja. Oh, I'm using a staple brush by Elf. I 
I'm gonna take Medium Beige by LA Pro, LA Girl Pro Concealer, and I'm gonna use that to highlight. So yeah. my dad always used to live in Trinidad and then they had my two brothers. My brothers are six and eight years older than me. Um, they had my two brothers and they came to Barbados to live for a little. And then they got pregnant, well my mom got pregnant with me when she was in Barbados. So I was conceived in Barbados. So I'm like, I'm like really like Trini Bajan. Like, I'm a trend Bajan. Like, I'm a trend Bajan, okay? If you don't like it, then too bad because I'm really a trend Bajan. Like, I was conceived in Barbados and I was born in Trinidad. So I'm really past the book for us. So I finally, well, I visited Barbados when I was younger, like a baby. I can't remember. I only, the only reason I know is because I have a stamp in my passport from when I were a baby, but I, I don't know anything about that trip. I always knew like my dad lived in Barbados and I'm Bajan. I always knew that when I was younger and stuff like that. So that was always like pretty cool. And then my brothers, we do, um, we do come an entrance. Yeah, well, now it's the SCA in Trinidad or the 11 plus in Barbados. But it was coming entrance back in like my day. So we do that. So when my brothers did that, my mom my mom sent them to Barbados to live with my dad. After they said it. The coming entrance. Because Trina was bad and she was afraid for her sons. So she was like, let me get them out of here. That's the story. That's what my mom did. And then later on I went. But I only lived in Maridos for like two years until I moved to the States. So then I moved to the States and I had like, I lived like all of my adolescence life in the States from like, 13 to before I went to the States I went back to Trinidad for one year and I went to the secondary school in Trinidad for like one year and then I went back to the States and then I went to middle school and then I went to high school and then sophomore year of high school <laughs> yo I was all over the place then sophomore year of high school um I left and I came to Barbados to go to, and I went to school here for like nine months and it was literally nine months like I left in October yeah I left in like late October and then I went back in like June and um yeah so I did I went so I was like 15 yeah I was 15 and I went to like UE Continuum and I did like classes so I have CXCs and a high school diploma. So yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna take Sasha Buttercup. Oh, and I also don't cream contour. I just, um, I contour with powder. So that's why you guys didn't see me do any cream contouring because I don't. 
um, I'm dark already. I don't think I have any need whatsoever to cream contour and that's also the reason why I use darker foundation because now I don't have to like layer all these different things on my face. I just use a dark foundation since I'm going to be highlighting and contouring in the first place. Yeah, I think that makes sense. Now I'm taking B45 in dark. Um, skin finish mineralized powder and I'm going to apply that on my face oh, yeah, eh, eh. Now for contouring, I'm gonna take Exotica makeup. This is, I guess, I guess it's a Beijing brand, um, and this is in cocoa bean. And I'm gonna use that to contour my face. I'm using an elf angle brush and the my face brush was a Cara face brush guys where did I stop with my story well that's me so I'm Trini, I'm Bajan. I lived in New York for a few years until I was like 20, from like 14 to 20. Um, I've been back in Barbados, well I went back in Trinidad first for like a year and now I'm back in Barbados for like two years now, two or three years now, yeah three years now. So that's my story. That's a little bit about me. For some reason, guys, I love to put like a butt chin. Is it a butt chin? Is that what you call it? But I like to put like a dark in the middle so I have like a little like cleft chin. Is it a cleft chin? like that yeah that's what I, <laughs> that's what I like to do and I feel like this um I feel like this exotica powder looks a little harsh on camera but honestly in person it's not that dark Anyway, I'm gonna go over it with some face powder. I'm gonna take some of the same powder that I did my. Why do words always like escape my brain? Like, I'm gonna take the same powder and a blending brush that I did my contouring with, and I'm just gonna put that in the crease of my eye to give it whatever, to give it whatever.
I'm gonna take Morphe, my Morphe palette, um, 35W, yeah, this one, with those colors that I love. I love this orange. It's the best thing ever, but I'm not gonna be using that right now. I'm gonna take my Morphe palette. I'm gonna take this nude-ish color. Wow, you really cannot see that right there. I'm gonna put it up under my brow bone. Then I'm gonna take my OPV palette, Gorgeous 2, and I'm gonna take, I don't know what I'm gonna take. This is supposed to be a natural look, right? But I'm gonna do a non-natural, okay. If this was a natural look, this is what I would do with my eyes, and that would be it. I wouldn't do anything else with my eyes. Um, mascara and lip gloss, right? But I'm going to do, I'm going to do pink eye, eye, eyeshadow because I love pink eyeshadow. Eye. It's a messy head, head. I'm taking this color right here. I love this palette, it's so pretty. Ooh. And my favorite one is like out. Oh, I damage it. I'm also gonna put that in my teardrop area. Above and on that, take on your top. Egg, bang your back. Right to the back off, back off. I'm using Alligator Eyeliner in black. And I also do my waterline on top. I'm gonna just take a little bit of the same <clears throat> face powder that I use over my eyes and use a little bit at the bottom. Mascara Kiss New York. I'm not putting any on, putting on any falsies.
I'm using you glow girl um, I guess big highlighter YGG 101 Twilight I don't know I don't know that's what it says at the back that's that's literally what it says back there so I'm literally just gonna put on a blow. Um, this song. I'm gonna put some um, shea butter on my lips because I cannot decide on a color. I literally just washed my hair, so I washed it um, and I combed it with a paddle, a paddle brush. So I'm just gonna spray my face now with MAC Fix Spray. And this is the finished product. Thank you guys for watching. Um, like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys on my next video.